Hey Cavaliers fans, it's a weekend full of basketball as the women's team suffered a tough loss last night and the men's team prepares for the Miami Hurricanes coming to town. I'm Sydney Seligman and this is Turbo. The women's basketball team suffered a tough loss against a strong Syracuse squad on the road. It was a back and forth battle throughout with the Orange able to hang on for a 72-68 win after the Cavaliers couldn't pull ahead late in the game. Junior guard Jocelyn Willoughby put together another great all-around performance as she notched a double-double with 25 points and 12 rebounds. Sophomore guard Brianna Tinsley also had a standout performance as she matched a career high with 19 points. Syracuse continued their strong season and were led by sophomore guard Tiana Mingakahia, who got her own double-double with 19 points and 14 assists. On the men's side, the third-ranked Cavaliers welcomed the Miami Hurricanes to town as they face off in a Saturday afternoon matinee. The Cavaliers will need to use this game to work out their kinks ahead of the looming matchup with Duke. One of the key factors to look for in this game will be rebounding. In Virginia's only loss of the season against Duke, they were out-rebounded for the first and only time in ACC play. Also, in their performance against NC State, they gave up 16 offensive rebounds, the greatest amount they've given up all season. These have been the Cavaliers' worst two performances of the season, so clearly there's a correlation between Virginia's rebounding efforts and performance on the court. This means that Virginia's three leading rebounders, Braxton Key, DeAndre Hunter, and Jack Salt, will need to be dominant forces on the glass. That's all for today. Make sure to tune in to WVA for all your UVA sports news.